on a fight like this, obviously there's so many people to thank, but I'll just suffice at this time to say that everybody's been fantastic. It's been unprecedented promotion, uh, amazing. And to get to this stage, obviously a lot takes place. So I want to recognize somebody on the dais, and that's Audi Palulo from Band of Promotion, because without him, we wouldn't have had the opportunity to fight Mr. Robotnikov and be in this position. Fifteen years ago, a young teenager walked into a gym in Belmore and sparred with a world champion kickboxer. That kickboxer, Tim Lane, later became his trainer. The reason why he became his trainer is because Chris Algieri, a young teenager, was the only one who really stood in there with him, took the punishment, and impressed Tim Lane. Tim Lane went and spoke to his trainer, Keith Trimble, and convinced him that he should be working with Chris Algeria. And for the next 15 years, Chris Algeria, Tim Lane, and Keith Trimble have been on several bond, no matter where they were. And have worked hard and worked together and have brought him to this stage, the biggest stage in boxing. At this point in time, I've been asked to collectively come up the trainers of Chris Algeria, Tim Lane, and Keith Trimble. Hello and welcome to the Chris Algieri Show. Chris Algieri is ready. He's here to put on a great show. And on Sunday morning, you guys will know how we do it in New York. Algieri. 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 Uh, I would like to thank everybody from the Venetian for putting this up so well. And I'd like to thank this guy behind me, Keith. He's been the glue to hold this whole thing together. Um, he's always been there for us. Also, Mike Kim, Tony Ritchie, and our new addition to the team, Mr. Stitch Duran. Thank you so much for being here. Uh, thank you, guys. Keep jumping. Thank you. Um, many years ago, Chris and I met, and you know, he was an accomplished, he an accomplished kickboxer, but there was one more goal that he wanted to achieve, and that was to win the ISKA World Kickboxing title. We did that, we achieved that together. After winning that title, and having a perfect record of 20 and 0, he decided he wanted to become a boxer. He wanted to become a world champion. Now coming from a kickboxing background, having no amateur boxing experience, not too many people in the boxing community ever gave Chris a chance. Tim Lane and myself, we always knew we had something special with Chris. And on June 14th this past year, Chris became WBO, right all the way, world champion. And on November 20, 23rd, Chris once again will become victorious, will remain undefeated, 21 and 0, and will become the new WBO, welterweight world champion. Thank you.